Hello everyone, this is WarriganaHu here, and welcome to episode 6 of Let's Play the SpongeBob SquarePants Do It Video Game. Last time we took it down a bubble blowing baby aunt. We didn't get all the chest chests or the Gibby Gibby tokens, so we'll be coming back here later. But for now, we shall be doing the second driving level, no any parking in time. But now we'll just be doing the the first normal challenge, no time wing or max challenge this time, because we actually got a lot of levels to go for the next platforming level, so yeah. So there you go, no we bugging in time. Anyway, stuff our game pretty hard. And by the way, here's a shortcut. Why through that wall? Yep. You should go through that wall. You oh, you get nothing. But dumb, you get dumbbells. So yeah, the starting up to good team. We got oil sticks everywhere, and actually that'll make you slip her up. Missed that 50 point dumbbell. I'm going backward because I have all the time in the world, not on st strict time limit. More ways to jump, and here's our first treasure chest right over here. So there you go, we've got 15 treasure chests. And those are hot sauce piles, they hurt you, just like in Battle Keep Burn. There's a key out there, but if you go down here, there's actually a treasure chest here. So I'll grab that, and we'll grab a key doing. Do it a second time round. And just check and see if we have twist chest. Not missing twist chest. Twist chest, twist chest, twist chest, twist chest. Now, yeah, we're going around that like again. Going around the track again, because. Yeah, some train levels are actually lapped tracks. So not point A, not all in a point A to point B. This is actually going around in laps. You'll especially see that in the time. Time challenge, wind challenge. Anyways, so you go. Here's the other path. It is this, this what the key key I'm missing? So, oh yeah. So we, if we go on this path, the key. yeah, just like sponges, another key. We got more than half the keys now. Still missing a treasure chest though. And I'm pretty sure we'll get it soon. Let's get this fourth key. And accidentally hit. <laughs> oh well. Let's see, we grab the nitro. We had to go out the web because we can't go on the so we're not talking that much, but we're just going around the tracks same amount of times over and over again, so there's not really much to talk. Yeah, I really don't like this track. There's too many... I hate the oil slicks. There's too They're now starting to put in TNT bars everywhere, which is not cool. And yeah, in the third lap, we get a ramp. Let's see, a ramp disappears here, and we get to go around the shortcut. I'll show you the shortcut later. For now, we're gonna go the wrong way. Because it doesn't really matter which way you go. If you go back here, we can get to the. unlock the exit and we can go to the exit, so. That's through, let's head to the finish line, and that's it, we're done. That's the old mini essay. Well done, SpongeBob and Patrick. Here is your reward. Oh, boy. <laughs> Chocolate. I'll have two chocolate banana splits with sprinkles, berry stars, and goober beans with extra sauce, please. Uh, you can let go now. I said let go, please. <laughs> what kind of old lady are you? I'll save you, SpongeBob. Yep, here we go. Our first boss of the game, finally. 
It's this thing. I forgot what's called. Is it a catfish? I'm not sure. But in this boss battle, you gotta let it avoid you, and when it's on the edge of the arena, you hit him by the back, he will start spinning a cartwheel, and he'll go down. Now, that's the first phase, he'll start unleashing the ton lady at us. In this case, all we gotta do is. Well, hit her, really. You can also reflect his ice pellets, too, but. I failed to do so, so oh well. You can cause with dash bites, belly or head smashing the tongue lay as well. So there you go. Yeah, like that. So there you go. There you go. Down to one third of his health. Now the tongue lay is going to act like a spinning, like one of the spinning enemies again, so. Oh god, we, now we got smashing. And what's done that? That's it. That's the boss done. As I now give you a good token, and the cussing will start, so I'll shut my mouth. was vanquished by an even more hideous creature coming from the deep ocean trench. Well, we lost our car again. Never mind the car. Where's the road? There's the road on the other side of the deep, dark, dangerous, monster-infested trench. <laughs> After gulping, SpongeBob and Patrick decided to throw in the towel. Luckily, Mindy arrived and showed them what was really going on back in Bikini Bottom. Plankton had transformed Bikini Bottom into Planktopolis. The sight of their city convinced our heroes to continue on to Shell City. So, in order to become men, they cried like little babies. But someone was hot on their tail. With no time to lose, Princess Mindy thought of a better idea, and our heroes quickly became men and marched toward the treacherous trench. To get to Shell City, you're going to need to cross the bottom of the trench. You can get to the bottom using this slide. The only way across the trench is along the bottom, but you have to get there first by traveling down the slide, past those sea monsters. Mm, the trench is pretty deep. And very dark. Oh, no sweat, Mindy. We're men now. Those sea monsters wouldn't scare a guppy. That's the spirit. Now get down there as quickly as possible. Yep. Now the woman. We are daddy da now the man. We aren't on the web. Okay, I'll stop while you're cop white. Anyways, here's our next slide level. Yep, right after the dry level and the boss. This is just literally called Rock Slide. And later, this slide now has one of How is that for you? Has, has one of the most infuriating time challenges in the entire game. Bow to get well Bo gets back in the next episode or two, but for now, we're just casually going through this level. So, yeah. Go to right here, you can get a trampoline now, jump you all the way here. So it's a nice shortcut. Also gives you a 50 point dumbbell. So that's nice. That's what it says, SpongeBob. Ow. Yeah. Now, jump down here. But now inside a monster, and for some reason his tongue has been split up. What a weird tongue he has. Must be painful. I see that was a shortcut. So yeah, if you want to say time, that's where you go. Look up below. And I got one 
Okay, but that's not good. Well, jump down here, and there's now jumping. It'll take you up to here. This path will lead you to your first treasure chest of this of rock slide. Just jump down here. This is a pretty good shortcut and way way to cut corners. But yep, is the first treasure chest right here. Seventeen. Mm, making some good progress. So yeah. To be on. This is a pre down long slime level. Probably the, mo probably the longest slime level in the entire game. But yeah. We're now in the trench. There's Monster and now we're man! We can beat this game. Now we're. <laughs> okay, no. Now here's where we can get another trench chest. Right here on the left. Unfortunately, I was too late. Didn't again, I spin a jump and I died. It's best, pass here every time I try to get a treasure chest. There's paths you can take to the left. Problem is, it's off screen, so you won't know how to naked unless you slow down and look around your surroundings. But by the time you do that, you already lost all your speed and therefore you lost your chance to get it. So, try now again. But yeah, jump over here. 1, 2, 5, 10, 50. <laughs> but that's not all. If we continue here on this path, we can get. Wait for it. Wait for it. I saw a green glow there. Could that be? Yes! Another treasure chest! 18. I'm 18 years old, that's on this side point out. So, yep. Only right, one more treasure chest to get, and we have all the treasure chests in the sliding level. In walk slide, blah blah blah. Again, again. These plus signs are quite easy. Gives you enough time to react. It's nice mm -hmm. checkpoints. Monsters, monsters for scary effects. You know, not scary. Going for tunnels. This was, this is the worst commentary ever. I'm sorry. Well, that was different. Jesus. I don't like came on. But yeah. More geysers. Like we need to get another dose and one top sits high in the tub. There's a 10 point dumbbell, but it's not really worth it. Yeah. Take the lead path first. Then take the white path so that you can lead into. Yeah, this. This fish with the weirdest and internal system ever. There's no trust just there. Let's go to the white. Oh wait, I jumped too early. Screw you, game. Uh. And now we got ba ba get there all the way from near. So I should be speeding this up, but I'm forcing you guys to watch it. So to make up for it, I'll make off some noises. Boom, boom, boom. Yay, boom, guys. Look. Jumpity jump. Let's go here and let's actually get our temple dumbbells. Still get hit though, so. <laughs> Take your left path again. Don't get a white dive again. This is different indeed. And let's try this again. This time now that I know where to go. There we go. Now we gotta avoid this thing. Got hit twice. So I'll leave died there. But there you go. The, the third and last twist chest in rock slide. <sighs> so we're actually we're now nearly at the end of this, thank god. Bo -bo -bom. Go away you spiky eyeballs. There you go, we're at the end. The finish line is in sight. We're halfway through the trench part of this level. I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Jumpity jump. Let's cross this finish line and tell Minnie about our victory. Holy cow! You actually did it? Of course we did. We're men. Yeah, right. Here's your reward. Just 
place is full of horrible, hideous, and disgusting monsters. You've got to cross the trench to get to Shell City. You have enough Goofy Goober tokens to earn your next ability, the Sponge Bowl. Strike-O-Matic! Oh, I forgot my spoon. No, Sponge Bowl. It's really useful on things you don't want to get too close to. You can now throw a bowling ball by pressing the B button. Those nasty bucket heads must be stopped. Shell City is on the other side of this dark, scary place. Real men aren't afraid of the dark. You need to get across this trench. Real men aren't afraid of the trench? Of course they're not. Just look out for monsters. <laughs> monsters. Find the way out of this trench so you can stop the evil reign of Plankton. So yeah, now we'll find the next platform level. I think it's called Not a Man, Nestle. Name out these C boxes. They basically replace the Shushu Tiki from Barbecue Barn. You get too close to them, they'll disappear unless you sneak up to them. XC, we now had Sponge Bowl. Let's upgrade immediately. So they get an exploding bomb. When upgrade, allows Sponge as much as Sponge to douse or anything that gets near. Press the B button to detonate it. So yeah, X saying as a splash through, except it's a bowling ball. So yeah, the bow ball from Battle Key Bone returns as an actual bowling loop. An upgrade and becomes a bomb. Nice. <laughs> so, next time in Let's Play the Sponge of Scrabble's Newbie Game, of course, you know, we're not going to be doing this. We're going to be going back to No Weed Parking Anytime, Walk Slime, taking care of the challenges there. And let me tell you, it's not going to be fun at all. So it's more again. Who? I'll see you next time. Night, people. Bye. <sighs>